Greetings, Poke fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Silver Let's Play, my very first journey through Gen 2 Johto. In the last episode, we got Ed the Abra into an Alakazam and defeated Whitney, um, which was great. And we were on our way to Eggertique City before I realized, oh wait, there's that whole Sudowoodo thing. I don't have the Squirt Bottle. And thank god I didn't delete Teleport on Alakazam. <laughs> Because we have to go back to Golden Run and get it. Because I don't know, I just don't know things in this game. So that happens. So now we gotta find the flower shop. Which I don't know where it is. <laughs> so hopefully it doesn't take me too long to figure that out. No? That's where the bike shop is. Okay, it's gotta be up here then. Him. Name Raider. Ah. Okay, well, I guess that's valuable. The Underground. No, nah, that's stuff I'll do later. Okay. This looks like the flower shop. Yeah! You order the score bottle attacks. Sweet! Oh, I have plenty of water, my lovely. All right, that's that's fine. Thanks. That was weird. Um. Well, I guess I'll see you guys again when I get back to the when I get back to where I was. And we're back. Uh, we got the squirt bottle, and I guess now we're gonna. Oh, birds. Ice berry. Whoa, that's fancy. All right. All right. This is a trainer, I can tell. I forgot to heal at the Pokemon Center while I was back there. That was dumb. Oh well. Too late now. We'll put Kenya in front. Get Kenya some experience. Kenya evolves level 20. So that's pretty cool. Psychic Mock. Does he have great ball dexterity as well? Okay, this Abra, thankfully, is just gonna... It, it literally can't do anything. Oh, but you know what's great? Now that I beat Whitney, my normal-type moves get a big power boost. Oh, come on. I really needed you to hit that the last time. There we go. Okay. Kenya, Savenya, Vavavishidua. Alright. Three times... Would be awesome, Kenya, please. Okay, I know that was three times, but I guess nine. Yes! Good for Kenya. A kadabara. Alright, we can do this. I know it's scary, I know it's evolved, and illegal. Oh, 15? Some BS. This it's five times. Oh, it didn't matter because we got a crit! Yes! Way to go, Kenya! That was awesome! Holy crap, that's a bunch of experience points. Alright! Alright, well I guess I'll I guess I'll just put Ed Beg in front. Ed's gonna end up battling a lot because he's you know, he's not traded, so he's he grows slower than Three of the other four. Okay, that's the little cut path, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Could have taken that way. I kind of regret don't. I don't regret that bad. And so my studies, I'm ready for any Pokemon. Are you ready for my all of the Schoolboy Allen sent out a Tangela. Perfect opportunity for an Ice Punch. Yet to Thunder Punch. Fantastic! I love it! Love it! Fantastic! I'm definitely using Ed to battle all the Kimono Girls because... Oh, I just realized in order to get Lapras, I have to have a Pokemon that knows Surf. Okay, here's what we knew about the Pseudo Budo. I'm gonna throw one ball at it, and if it breaks out, I'm gonna knock it out. Because I don't care about Pseudo Budo, 
and like you can if I really want it I can get it back after the I de defeat the elite four so like like It's not worth my time to try and waste all my Pokeballs trying to catch it. Because I want to make sure I have a stock of Pokeballs on me in case I run into a random Shiny. For a second there, I thought that one might be Shiny. I was like, oh my god, what? <laughs> but it's not. So it's fine. Alright, one more confusion. Aha! I resist you. Don't resist that. That might hurt. Okay, we're gonna switch into Rocky. Oh, my large rock snake! Oh, low kick. Well, low kick's not gonna burn. It's not stabbing my defense is very high. Even though it's super effective, I doubt that it will do very much. Okay. We're gonna use one great ball. And then I'm knocking it out. All right, screw you, Zudu. Okay, we use we use one more. That got closer than I expected. All right, screw you, Pseudo Wudo. Getting my hopes up twice in a row. Die to my dig. Look at that neat little pile. Stupid tree. Alright, I'm gonna put Kenya back in front, because I'm pretty sure we're, like, super close to Ecritique now. And I don't want to waste a potion if I don't have to, since I'm, like, super poor. <laughs> what does this say? Trainer tips. Use Dig to return to the entrance of any place. It is convenient for exploring caves and other landmarks. That's true. We are not as close as I thought we were. Alright then. This guy likes to use hypnosis. We need to KO this thing, we need to KO this thing right now. <laughs> Come on, Kenya. Five hit fury attack. Come on. What? Well, this is horrible. All right, try that dream meter again. Freaking try it. Okay. All right, Rocky, come on. Please miss. Yes! Alright, we did it. That got sticky, but we did it. How, how are we not to Ecritique City yet? That's what I want to know. Alright, who are we gonna put in front? Both Ken, we'll put uh, we'll put Sanic in front. I'm gonna use Sanic in like four episodes. Oh hey, we made it! Nice. What? What is going on? Hi, I'm Bill, and who are you? Mm, Michael, huh? You've come at the right time. I just finished adjustments on my time capsule. You know that Pokemon can be traded, right? My time capsule was developed to enable trades with the past. But you can't send anything that didn't exist in the past. 
Because your starter just happened. Doesn't work like that. If you did the PC in the past, it would have a breakdown. So you have to remove anything that wasn't around in the past. Put simply, no sending new moves or new Pokemon in the time capsule. Don't you worry, I'm done with the adjustments. Tomorrow, time capsules will be running at all Pokemon centers. I have to hurry and get back to Golden Run and see my folks. Bye bye Alright, well, now we get to the point where I can trade with uh, Red, Blue, and Yellow. Fun fact. Alright, while she's doing that, what level are Morty's Pokemon? Because, like, I'm feeling pretty good that I could mess him up. I have to specify Pokemon, because otherwise it's just Rick and Morty. Uh, gold, silver, and crystal. 23! Okay, so it's a bit higher than my Pokemon, but it's not that bad, actually. Like... I feel like... I might be able to get Lapras... at the end of this episode. Where are the Kimono Girls? I know I have to beat them... in order to get Surf. What's this? That's the burn tower. Please stay away as it is unsafe. Okay, I wanna put... I wanna use, um... I wanna use Ed for the Kimono Girls, because he's got the most coverage. Where is their house? Is it, like, gonna be clear to me what their house is? Is this it? Dance Theater, this is it. Creepy old guy standing outside, so that's a good sign. Okay, so they don't make you battle them all in a row. I think they do that in Soul Silver. Okay, Flareon's fine. I'm just confusing this. The only one I'm concerned about is Umbreon. I did less than I want to. Oh, but the confusion's nice. Come on. Yes! And that's enough for a KO. Sweet! Ed's level 20 now. Kimono girl Naoko was defeated. Oh, you were very strong. I know, thank you. Okay, so their outfit colors have nothing to do with what evolution they have, because that's a green outfit and she had a fire type. Sayo. Espeon. It's occurred to me I have, like, nothing that's good against psychic types. But there's, like, no dark type options in this game, so... Oh, that was sick! One more Thunder Punch, we can do this Alakadam! Show who the superior psychic Pokemon is. Oh, come on. Dang it. Alright, we'll just finish you off with the confusion. You have been defeated. Goodness me, they give you a lot of experience points here. I want to see if I can do something with Kenya. I'm a Jolteon still a possibility. Well, Kenny can switch out. It's fine. So I want Kenny to evolve. Kenny's the weakest member and close to evolving. And its power is going to go way up when it evolves. Come on, a girl, Zuki. Umbreon. We can beat this thing. Oh my god, it is so tanky. Holy crap. How much does this do? More than I would like. Just gotta get it. Gotta get some... Oh, come on. Why are you only hitting twice? Come on. I need you to hit... Five times. Five times I think would knock out. Right now. Oh, and you... Of course, I mean, one was a crit, so that's fine, but... Ah! Okay, I think Pet can knock out from this range. I hate my life. 
Oh, no, I don't! Yes! Oh boy, Kenya! Oh, a thousand? Whoa! Oh my god! It's all- Kenya's gonna evolve. I'm not even gonna run back. I'm gonna put Kenya in and then immediately switch it out. Just so it evolves right now, because I don't want to wait. I don't want to run back to the Pokemon Center. I don't got time for that. Cooney. All right, this is a job for all of us. Um. Get some Thunder Punch in here. Let's go, Ed. Every time I see its icon, I'm like, oh god, why do I have a Mr. Mime in my party? And that's not—it's not a Mr. Mime. It's way cooler than a Mr. Mime. Your choices, Nintendo, I question them. Vaporeon is also bulky. Oh, come on, why you gotta be like that? Why you putting sand in my eyes? Alright, didn't matter. Psybeam. That doesn't show me the power. Alright, guys, I'll be right back. I have to look up what, whether Confusion or Psybeam is stronger because I don't know. Okay, Psybeam is stronger than Confusion and has like the exact same effect 10% chance of confusing. So we're getting rid of Confusion. And keeping Teleport around because I like having that. <laughs> Alright. Kenya is evolving! Kenya, Savenya, Baba Bichidoa. Wow, that is a great Firo sprite. My team is so stacked, guys. <laughs> Alright, the last one is Jolteon, so I'm just gonna put uh, Rocky right in front. And then. 10 minutes left in this episode? I'm gonna challenge the gym, because I can do whatever I want. Minnow Girl Miki. Your Jolteon is no match for me. I don't like that. Don't like that at all. Please don't miss, Onyx. Please don't miss. God, freaking! Come on, man! No, no! Stop it! All right, if we miss again, I'm switching out. Oh yes! There we go. Oh, a crit! I hope that still would have knocked out, even though if there, even if there wasn't a crit. So. So I defeated all of them. I think I'm supposed to get Surf after that. Oh, the Commander Girls, great dancers. They're also skilled at Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I've never even left a scratch. The way you battled, it was like watching a dance. It was a rare treat to see. I want you to have this. Don't worry, take it. Oh, yes! I have to catch a Pokemon that knows Surf. <laughs> all right, but first we're gonna battle the gym. I'm very excited for this, everyone. Because I got two Pokemon that are going to be just fine. Onyx and Alakazam are both quite good. Alakazam's less good because he's weak to the hits. Um, but Onyx... It's still super effective. It, it hits harder than Onyx does. Who do I have in front? Rocky's in front. Rocky's higher level. We'll put uh, we'll put Ed in front. Okay, it's slightly higher level, but I feel like Ed's just gonna be able to sweep everything, and I have to figure out this invisible floor puzzle. Goody. Sage Ping. Okay, he's just gonna have several Gaslies. All right, that's immediately apparent. Whoa! 
Oh, that animation is intense! It's just like, nothing, and then... <laughs> oh, that's thoroughly entertaining. Yeah, who needs dark types in this ghost type jam? That animation is fantastic. Psy just psy beaming everything down. <laughs> Five Pokemon's annoying though. I suppose it does make it easier to. <laughs> I'm just so thoroughly entertained by that. I'm, I'm looking forward to having this move for a long time. <laughs> Another ghastly? No. Simon. Okay, one more, and then we've defeated one guy. <laughs> are there two gym trainers, or are there three? No. Alright, we'll use Rocky for the next one. I like the idea of trying to beat him with Ed, though, because Ed is faster and hits harder than Rocky does. It doesn't take, it takes the hits far worse. If he gets hit by an attack, he's screwed. But I think Ed has higher sweeping potential and then won't have to deal with hypnosis if it could just knock out the Pokemon before they even have a chance. Okay. All right, then. Okay. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, I was doing so well. There's four of them? They definitely make you walk all the way over to the person. Defeat me if you want a hint. Well, you are one crazy old lady. Oh, da! All right, Rocky. Let's dig down underground. Aha! Your spite means nothing if you... If I haven't used a move yet. He doesn't quite one-shot, which is sad. Oh, well. Oh, we outsped him that time. That was weird. Why did we outspeed him that time? Oh, already level 23. Wow. Arden? At level 23? No! Yes! Rocky, what are you doing? Okay, another Haunter. We will dig you down. Maybe we'll get a crit this time. You never know! Don't you lick me. I know you need your... You know how deers lick rocks to get salt in their diet? I feel like that's what Hunter was just trying to do. And that's like... No. Don't do that. Don't do that to Rocky. He doesn't like that. Fine, I shall tell you the secret of the invisible floor. The path is right before our eyes. What? 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 That's, that's... What does that even mean? Is it like, barely... discerned, like the invisible walls in Koga's gym? Because I can't see crap. Okay, you didn't have to walk all the way over there, which is... Okay. Nuts. Okay. Up. Over to the square before the lady. Up to. Over to the man. Up to the lady. Up again. Okay. Up again. Alright. You know the square in front of the trainers. Okay. This episode's gonna go a little bit long. It's already at like 26 minutes. But. Well, I did cut, I'm cut out some parts of it. Hopefully I remember to cut the parts out. Because <laughs> I'm going to be editing this like a way after I record it. Because I'm bulk recording right now. 
God, that's fantastic. That's just so... F I love that animation. Another one shot. Fantastic! Way to go, Ed! Sage Jeffrey was defeated. Wins and losses I experienced both. Alright, I don't care. Where did Pokemon come from? This guy's not helpful. Gahai way! This puzzle is so annoying. Am I gonna make it? Okay, well it doesn't matter now. I need to go back and heal. Made it to the last trainer. She looks so insane! <laughs> Martha! Martha! Mmm! <laughs> I like how they made like a ghost type gym leader and he like doesn't even have a mischievous. <laughs> like, <laughs> what are you doing? Use the new, use the new gen ghost type. Why, why are you not doing that? I love how Ed's just coming in here just like, blah, 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 just like obliterating everything with energy beams. Are we gonna get to 24 before the battle? Psybeam. Yes! All right! Well, let's go back and heal, and then let's take on Morty. Meaning, we're gonna get to be able to use Surf, and it's Friday, which means I can go get Lapras at the very beginning of the next episode, which I'm gonna do, like, immediately after finishing this one. I have to catch a water type first, though, which is annoying. So I'm gonna do that first. Oh, but I don't have the HM for Strength. Another thing I'm gonna need. So... There might be actually a solid chunk of things I have to do off camera. <laughs> but let's go fight Morty. Okay. Yeah, we made it! Woo! Alright. We got Alakazam in front. All right, Ed. Psychic type to beat ghosts. Good of you to have come. Your Necrotique Pokemon have been revered. It's said that legendary Pokemon will appear to the truly powerful trainers. I believe that tale, so I have secretly trained here all my life. Secretly, you're a gym leader. As a result, I can now see what others cannot. Just a bit more, a little more, I could see a future in which I meet the legendary Pokemon. You're going to help me reach that level. I never agreed to anything, sir. Weirdo. Leader Morty. Your Ghastly is about to get laser blasted to death. <laughs> Fight Simeem! One down. Three to go. A Haunter, we will not change Pokemon. Simeem again! I hope this one one shots. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Alright, he's bringing out the big guns. The big guns, I guess is what I should say. Oh, it's 25? I thought it was 23. Oopsie. It's might still one shot though. Oh yeah! Double D! <laughs> so good! <laughs> All right. Well, this is over. I mean, the Haunter is weaker than the Gengar, and there's no way I don't one shot this ha this Haunter. Like, didn't take a hit. What a incredible destructive dismantling of Morty. Fantastic. Ed, you are so good. So good. I love Alakazam. <laughs> Especially in the earlier gens. 
What is TM34? Is it Shadow Ball? Shadow Ball, but that's a physical move. Which is like, stupid in this gen. Let's leave! All right, guys, that is gonna be the end of this episode. Um, off camera, I need, I'm gonna head back to Union Cave, because it's still Friday, and I need to catch this Lapras. So off camera, I'm gonna go find it. Um, and I also need strength. I'll get that off camera, too. Uh, so at the beginning of next episode, we catch an Lapras. Well, actually, hold on, let me check something real quick. Well, guys, upon further inspection, I don't actually get the strength HM until I get to Olivine City, which is something I have to do in order to get Lapras. So, I actually am gonna, I was considering doing the Lapras stuff just at the end of this episode, because I could fit it in, but I do have to do some other stuff before I can do that. So, that is gonna be the end of this episode. Next episode, we're gonna get Lapras, and I guess I'm gonna sign off for now. So, that is all I have for now. <laughs> and until next time, big events. Gotta catch them all!